Welcome back to A to Z Quality Fencing. We're doing another segment of what's going on at A to Z Quality Fencing. Today we have Zane, which is our uh, um, office boss. We we'll give him a, and then we have Carly, and we have Avery. Carly and Avery are members of a 4-H here in Washington County, and uh, the big event's coming up. Yeah. Tell, Carly, tell us what the big event is. Washington County Fair. Or like the livestock show and auction. Yep, Avery, tell us, tell us what your favorite thing is. I don't know, probably showing the animals in the arena. It's pretty cool and fun. What animals are you showing this year? Rabbits and pigs. Pigs, three rabbits. How many each? We both have two. Two pigs, one rabbit. My rabbit's name is Sonia. My girl pig's name is May. And my boy pig's name is Smokey. My rabbit's name is Doug. Doug? Yup. My guilt, which is my girl pig, is Penny. And then my boy is Tennessee. What is the, what do you like about the 4-H the most? The 4-H in general, I just like how like interactive you can be with like other people, other families. It's like nice to be able to talk to other people about like the same like Organization, if that makes sense. Nope. Nope, you can't use her answer. You gotta come up with your own. You don't know. Animals. You like the animals? Yeah. How much time do you spend with the animals during fair season? Like a two day? Or let's, let's go out a day. How much? A day. About two to three hours a day, right? I'd say more than that. Yeah. People don't realize the commitment these these, these young adults have to these projects because they are absolutely right that there's probably a minimum of two hours a day yeah, and on days there, there's more than that as they get mm -hmm. closer to the fair there's more than that and then there's the other side of it is the monetary side of it it's not cheap no, no. to raise it's not these cheap animals at all. Um, people think they see the auctions like oh look at the money they're making uh, when you take out what it costs for that pig Initially, you take out the food and everything, the shots, everything that goes with the equipment, and uh, it's it's not a really lucrative thing, you know. So that's why we want to make sure as businesses we're supporting what these uh, um, young adults are doing. And so I I appreciate what you did. I remember doing it with my kids and whatnot, and it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work for the parents too. Yeah. Yes. It's not just family. It's still not just you guys. Your family are. are you know, dedicated to this and, and dove into this as a family and it's, it's awesome to watch them watch them do this. What's the hardest thing about the project? Training and preparing. Yeah. Lots of time and lots of and patience. Making sure your animal is perfect and not sick or doesn't look well. Yeah, tell us why somebody should come to the auction. To support the 4-H and FFA members. Like you don't even have to like you don't buy to, any animal. Yeah, but just, just to show up and be there to support the kids is amazing. Yeah. I, I agree 100%. And you don't have to bid or anything. It just, it makes the kids realize how many people are like invested in this. It's not just you putting it all the work. And even like for some animals that don't make the sale and like small businesses that just come and buy those, many people very greatly appreciate that. Yes. yes, I encourage whether you have the largest business, whether you have the smallest business, whether it's a family business, whatever it is, I encourage you to come support the local fair and 4-H, um, the livestock sale, as well as the um, small animal. Yeah, the small, small animals. animal auction too well they all need they all need supporting and as businesses we need to do a better job of supporting all of these young adults especially the small animals there's not as many bidders that come True. to that than but the large animals but you should because they work just as hard as the people hard. Like they that's even yep absolutely yeah so awesome one last question what's your favorite fence company a to Z, Z. Z. <laughs> Good job.